In this video we're going to continue with our object orientated programming version of Pong and we're going to create the ball class and put a stationary ball on the screen. Okay so let's add our ball. The first thing I want to do is add in a ball class so we want to use class and ball and it's going to be um, type object so then we're going to um, set its constructor or initialization method um, and this one we do want it to take in some variables so it can take in its x position its y position um, its x velocity its y um, velocity um, it's going to have a size, so we'll call that its radius, which makes sense for a ball, and it can have a colour, not spelled like that, a colour um, as well. Then um, I want to set the actual variable got, so self.x, that's the x that's going to go with the objects that created, it's going to have the x that we give it, then we're going to have self. Um, dot y is going to equal the y. You can see what's going to be happening here. Um, whoops, we're going to have, uh, come on. Then we're going to have self dot vx equals vx, self dot vy equals vy, um, self um, dot, whoops, dot radius equals radius and finally self dot color equals color okay so that's the initialization uh, method then um, let's describe the move method and you'll recognize this from our um, one where it wasn't um, object orientated so Oops, let's go back. I'm making a lot of these mistakes today. So we're going to say self um, dot x. So we're going to change the x value to whoops, plus equals self um, dot vx. And then obviously you've guessed what the next one is. Self dot y um, plus equals self dot vy. So that's all that's required. We've also got to be able to draw our ball. So let's call that draw. And that's going to be um, self. But it's also got to take um, a surface as well. Again, you can call it what you want, but we want to, we've got to be able to tell it where to actually draw itself as well. So this is just going to be our normal code. So pygame dot draw. Um, dot circle and then it's going to be surface which we will specify when we um, when we actually create the object um, so it's going to be self dot um, color and then it's going to have to be given a position which we given the form of a tuple just like we did before so that's self dot x comma um, self dot y then we whoops too far then we're going to have to give it a size so that's self dot radius and then I want it um, colored in so or filled so it's going to be zero that's all that's required and then I want um, now this is not going to use this today but I want to define a rectangle that surrounds our and ball. And this is so that we can do collision um, detection later on. So all we're going to do is we're going to return um, the rectangle. So we're going to um, return and then it's going to be um, pygame dot rec and then this is the rectangle so it's going to be and the self dot x that should be self explanatory but um, because it's the center that's given we're going to have to take away self dot radius and then we have to do the y one so that's going to be self dot y and we're going to have to take away the radius so kind of clear there and then we want to do the width which is basically going to be two um, times um, the radius and then we're going to have to do the height, which is going to be two times the 
whoops, the radius. Um, so that's our um, our ball object. So now what we want to do is we want to create an instance of that object in our game. So I'm just going to put that here. So we're going to call it um, self dot ball. So we've now got this object called ball. Let me put that F in there. And ball that's created within the game class, and that's going to be um, of type ball and or class ball and then we need to put in our information so we need to put in its x coordinate well let's have it start at 250 it's got to have its y coordinate 150 i want to put it in the middle it's going to have a velocity of three which we won't be using um x velocity of three y velocity of three won't be using that yet we have a radius of 10 this is a nice thing about pi game by the way i've created this object and it does include that in the uh, the hints it's given you there and then the color obviously we can change all this later that's going to be um, the black one that I've created already and we're almost there but we've got to draw it otherwise nothing's going to happen so I'm going to put that one here self dot ball and then we want to call the draw method of ball and it needs to be given a surface so that's self dot and we call it up here screen okay so hopefully crossing our fingers that will um, be correct so I'm just going to bring that up current and bring it over and there we are so nothing to happen at the moment just a ball in the middle of the screen I hope that you found this video helpful. There's a link to the code in the description below. Stay in Infield with Winfield.